Kwa kampuni ya safari kwa msasa inasema kwamba haipingi kama juhudi za kujumuisha baadhi ya biashara za kampuni shindani za Airtel na vile vile Telkom bali inashauriana na serikali kuhusu jinsi inavyoweza kuchangia kufaulu kwa kujumuisho huko. Kulingana na kaimu afisa mkuu mtendaji Michael Joseph ni kwamba hofu ya safari kwa minahusu kutolipua deni la shilingi bilioni moja nukta mbili ambalo inadai kampuni hizo mbili baada ya kujumuishwa pamoja. Na vile vile Joseph amesema kwamba hayo ni katika hafla ya kutangaza matokeo ya nusu mwaka ya kampuni hiyo katika kipindi kilicho malizika September Safaricom ilipata faida ya shilingi bilioni 35.7 baada ya kutozwa ushuru. All we want to make sure is that these spectrum parity that we each have the same amount of spectrum because with the merger between Airtel and Telkom they will have much more spectrum than we have. We have many more customers to service, but nevertheless, we just like to see spectrum parity that we each have the same. And that's standard all over the world. The second thing we said is that we want to have our debt paid before the merger happens because we're concerned that when Telcom merges with Airtel, we will not see our money.